The holidays is a time for spirits, and I'm just talking about the ghost spirits. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking Whiskey to Bach has some great ideas for you for cocktails to enjoy the holiday season and a new club. Yeah. And Jenny, this is exciting. And listen, they don't pay me. I'm not on the payroll. I'm not endorsed or anything like that. Don't worry, people. But this is definitely a whiskey yeah. I enjoy around the campfires. I take it mm -hmm. camping with me because it's made with mesquite wood, mesquite, right? Yeah. So tell me a little about the, the whiskey. More. Yeah, so our flagship is Dorado, and that's the one that you, we gave you last time. It's made with mesquite smoke. We smoke the malt, and um, it was kind of the catalyst for this idea from our founder. His wife said, what if you mesquited it instead of peated it? And so that's why we have our Dorado. We also have our classic, um, but most of our whiskeys that we're known for are all with mesquite smoke. And we gotta give a little story about this, because mm -hmm. it all started where a furniture builder yes. was having all this old wood around and stuff, brought it home one day to burn, yes. and it started to give the aroma while he was actually having a little bit of whiskey. He was having some scotch. Yeah, scotch yeah. it was. And him and, him and his daughter were his like, wife. you know what, yeah. a wife, and then daughter got involved. Yes. And see, I know a little bit about it. <laughs> so there you go. I like Jenny's here to correct me all the way. Yes, yes. But what I love is that it is Arizona whiskey, right mm -hmm. down in Tucson area, which yeah. is really nice. Um, but you guys have started something new. We have. Which you're excited about. Yeah. Uh, not just the club, but a new whiskey, scotch, what we do we call it? We have a new rye whiskey. Ooh. So we've been known for our American single malts for over a decade, um, our classic in Dorado. This is our 11th year this month, actually, that we've been uh, distilling out in Tucson, Arizona. But we just launched Sentinel Rye Whiskey. This is the first thing that we haven't made grain to glass in our distillery, but we finished it with a Southwest flavor. Ooh. So we brought it in during the summer, aged it in our mesquite wet casks, let, really let those barrels breathe, and then we filtered it over the mesquite charcoal to really make it a little bit smoother. So I know there's those rye drinkers that love the bold brash. Yeah. It still has those notes, but it's a little bit more refined so that you know the non-ride drinker may enjoy it as well. I, I like that. Yeah. And that's where you bring in Spencer, the yes. mustache guy. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, and, and you're from, again, Arizona. Arizona Wilderness in downtown Phoenix. There so you I run go. the cocktail program down there. I love it. And so yeah. you actually have a cocktail that uh, put together using their new uh, yeah. rye whiskey. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. We were so excited to get the Sentinel rye in the building. So uh, I thought we would make a holiday cocktail. Let's Good do it. Good for parties and right. everything you have going on during the holidays. Yeah. So, so a very important thing that he's doing here, people. Listen very carefully. Yeah. Listen very carefully. Big rocks. Big That's rocks where it is. Always. Don't throw the little things in there. And you can go any one of these, like, you know, wine shops or everything like that and get one of those molds, mm -hmm. which you highly yeah, recommend, yeah, don't super you? Super easy, right? There you go. Okay. Yeah. So what we're we going to get it kicked off with some singed orange bitters from Blue Clover. Okay. It's a local distillery. Uh, we're making three cocktails in one, so we're going to go about two ish drops. Three cocktails for one person? Uh, three cocktails oh. in one glass. No, <laughs> it's still a little early for that. Ooh, what do you mean? It's almost 10. <laughs> <laughs> Meaning that in another country, it's nine o'clock at night. True, so, true, all true, right. true. Yeah. So, and then fine. this is a uh, syrup I made at home. It's just some cinnamon, uh, brown sugar, simple syrup. So yeah. easy to make. It's not difficult at all. No, you, so you just made it right at home. Yeah, oh, yeah. Nice. It takes five right. minutes on the stove. Okay. Super simple. What do we got next? Uh, then we're gonna go in with the rye. Okay. Uh, this is the Sentinel Rye from Del Bach. All right. And it is absolutely delicious. Like Jenny said, there's not gonna be a whole lot of like a, a spice characteristic. Nothing too bold. But we do have those beautiful rye notes that are good to come out. Love it. I know we got and two minutes here as you're pouring yeah. in there. Oh, well, you sure? This is who's this for? This one drink, right? Yeah, this is one drink for you. Okay, yeah. that's what I'm just saying. And then we're gonna finish up with Happy some Happy holidays! <laughs> Did I see right. a ghost? No, it's just the spirits in the glass. <laughs> Perfect. And then... All right. So again, the big, the big. Uh, I want to move this yeah, trigger out absolutely. so you can see. All right. So now, what do we do? Then we're gonna strain over another fresh cube. All right, and when you poured, you did a little bit of... Uh, yeah, any apple cider you get, um, okay. anything from the store works perfect. All right, and so then what do we got next? And, and, then, and this is important, garnishing, yeah, right? We are going to garnish with a cinnamon stick and then an orange peel. All right, go ahead and let's yeah. see how that... Now, this so, is very important with... The orange peel you want to twist, try to get some of those orange oils out. Look at yeah. that. And then around the, glass, around the glass. Cinnamon stick. Cinnamon stick. There we that's go. That's all you. So that's it right there. Yeah, absolutely. This is a very easy one to make. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Simple. So, you can I'll, make a big batch at home, get them ready for the party, do whatever. Yeah. Okay. So now what What's what about, is this thyme? Is that what you put a little that's bit That's rosemary. Rosemary. Yeah, yeah. So this cocktail I made earlier is a uh, whiskey sour with a cranberry thyme mixer from Iconic Cocktail Company. Oh, nice. Really great local company. Really great mixers. Makes making oh. um, things at home super simple. I like it. All right. Yeah. Let me take a little. Yeah. Get a sip. 
Mm, I love it. What do you think? Okay. Of course, it's, yeah. you know, there you go. <laughs> Jenny, very quickly, the club that you say is a great gift yes. for those who are whiskey drinkers. Yeah, the Whiskey Club, you can find information on it, our website, whiskeydelbach.com. Um, we've got two different tiers, and you get discounts on whiskey, merchandise, um, as well as great member events. It's, it's a really great gift opportunity. There it is. Yeah. All right. We got our cocktail. We got, of course, gifts. Got a lot of fun for you.